Hey you guys, AK47 Master here back with some more new Super Mario Brothers and on this episode we are going to be going continuing on through World 5 because on the last episode we defeated Bowser Jr. in the Tower of World 5 and he retreated back to the World 5 castle and I see World 5 a lot alright and let's pick up that fire flower for later and I noticed a lot in the beginning of the let's play in the let's play I was collecting a bunch of items and can I get the one up? Oh no, I can't. They won't let me. The game won't let me. And this level is pretty cool. <laughs> a lot of slippity and sliding. And for Mario, Mario loves slippity and sliding. And let's see. Hold on, let me do a jumping start. No, I not a not a ground pound start. Oh no! All right. See so, yeah. out. All right. So if you guys do that, uh, the game will push you through. As Big Mario, it's the game's just like, oh, you're too fat, just get off. And these these guys are super annoying. Look, how am I supposed to even get on there? And they don't die; they just keep on pushing them out of the way. It's just like, move, get out the way. I'm trying to get some star coins. And all right, I thought I was gonna be there all day. All right. So, what was I going to talk about? I was going to talk about something. Oh. Uh, nope, I still can't think of it. Oh, I wanted to talk about one of my, uh, one of my favorite YouTubers ever, which is Ashen. Ashen's. Most, some of you may know him. I don't know about most of you. He does, uh, Poundland item reviews, and if you don't know what Poundland is, uh, I don't blame you, because neither do I. It's actually, a uh, uh, British, I'm not sure, a UK store? It's basically like a 99 cent store. It's the UK equivalent of a 99 cent store. If you don't know, uh, the UK, uh, currency is the pound. So, pound land, so it only costs one pound. Ha ha ha, get it? <laughs> and, alright, one up station over there. And, I feel like I should get some, some type of item. Let's go back to World 3 and see if there's any mushroom shops available that I didn't already use. Chances are I already used them. Not over there, not over there, nope, nothing. Let's go to World 2. Alright, I don't want to waste my star coin, so I'll just get a mega mushroom. <laughs> That'll be fun. So yeah, Ashen does Poundland reviews, and he's quite he's quite hilarious. His humor, I think, is really funny in all of his videos, pretty much. And he, uh, and he's just so classy. He's so classy that he gets dressed up in a suit, like literally a tuxedo suit, for every YouTube video he makes. Although he does pretty much kneel or sit over uh, his, uh, whatchamacallit, his couch when he makes his videos. So I guess that kind of defeats the purpose of getting in a suit. And... Uh, but he is very humorous and crap. It's like certain levels, Mega Mario just isn't meant to be used in. <laughs> like the water level in World 3, we got stuck in the water. And alright. But yeah, it just seems like certain levels you just not meant like you're just not meant to use them at all. You know what I mean? And these guys are really annoying. These like fighting ghosts. It reminds me of like some type of like ghost type Hitmonchan. That would be cool. Like I know uh you know people have made uh, arts like certain Pokemon arts of like let's say like what would Dark Arcanine look like? What would a ghost Hitmonchan look like? That would be interesting. And now we're on this creepy elevator that or creepy elevator? Yeah, I guess so, kind of. And it just fell down. I don't care. This is kind of weird. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what to say about that. But let's get this boo out of the way. 
and enter the door. So yeah, I don't know what I was talking about, but anyways, the point is, Ashens is awesome. So, go check him out. I'll probably leave his link in the description if you don't already, aren't already subscribed to him. And check out his, uh, his item reviews. He makes longer videos, like half an hour, 45 minutes. So if you're rendering a video, like most of the time I tend to be rendering a video, then check him out. You will not regret it. Alright. So going on to world 5-4, it's actually an on-rails level, yeah, it's very annoying. Oh, let's get that mushroom. Alright. Okay. We got bullet bills, bullet bills, and it kind of seems like I just rushed through world 5. I'll probably have to do some of the secret levels. Probably have to show you guys some of that, because I think that would be cool, don't you? I think so. Alright, that crap. Let's avoid getting hit by bullet bills. And I always wondered about the logic of the bill bullet bills, because apparently they're supposed to be bullets. Meanwhile, they're slow as molasses. Hell, I mean, even Mario can run faster than the bullets. Just imagine Sonic having a race with a bullet bill. It would it would be a joke. It wouldn't even be a race. It would be like the tortoise and the hare, except it actually had logic. It actually worked the way it should have worked. As in the hare won the you know the race. And oh that is a tease. That look at all those coins. Look at that. That is a freaking tease. That is a tease. You don't even know. Like, you don't even know. Wow, Nintendo, uh, Miyamoto, you won that. I give you credit for that. That was smart. Just place two star coins there next to each other. Just to tease the player. You are smart. Alright, and one up. No, I shall get you one up. Actually, I shouldn't walk aimlessly to the right of the screen. Because I'll probably get bombarded with... Like Koopa Troopers or Goombas or something. That reminds me of like uh, what's that thing called? Oh crap! I didn't get any star coins for this level. This is sad. <laughs> Whatever. That reminds me of what? What the heck's that thing? It's that Mario character that sh I thought should have been in Brawl. Uh, pink Yoshi. No, it's not, it's not like a Yoshi. Birdo. That's what it's called. Birdo. And that's the question. Is Birdo a male or a female? Because it, uh, it has a pink ribbon on it, except it's Birdo. And like Latin language, usually O at the end of someone's name usually indicates that they're a male. So, I don't know. Answer in the comments. Is Birdo a male or a female? But anyways, that's about it for this episode. On the next one, we actually won't be taking on the castle. Well, at least we won't be taking on the castle right away we'll be doing uh, some uh, secret levels starting with world 5a didn't think i'd forget about these did you all right see you guys then